The dumbbell bent over row to the chest is an excellent exercise, again, to work the back of the shoulder and the muscles between your shoulder blades. Gary's going to get into perfect posture here as he flexes forward to about a 45 degree angle. Again, we want that nice line from his ear to his shoulder to his hip. His hands are going to be about shoulder width apart and he's going to row out with his elbows going out, forming a nice line from elbow to elbow across his back. Squeezing up, controlling the weight and moving down. To increase the difficulty of this, Gary can move into a unilateral type movement where he's only going to row one arm at a time, engaging his core, getting his abdominal muscles to work at a higher level versus working both arms at the same time. Now to change the emphasis of the muscle, Gary's going to switch his hands into a neutral grip and he's going to keep his elbows in nice and tight. Gary's going to do the same type of rowing movement, keeping the elbows in, and this is going to put a little bit more emphasis on his uh, lat muscles, the big wing muscles in, in our backs. Now it's very important, you can see Gary's got excellent posture here. You do not ever want to let your back round when you're in this position. Very important to keep your back solid, strong, and not let your back flex. And those are the dumbbell bent over rows to the chest and waist.